to play a game. It's easy. I said, I wonder if you can actually do a game in the easy language basic, the language fifth graders can use, that only does about 100 things a second. I wonder if you could make a ball move fast enough to actually be a good game. So I took my game of breakout and programmed it one day, wrote a couple of basic statements and had some bricks. Change their color, change their color again, change their color again, whole bunch of times. Then I programmed to draw a little paddle, make it a little bigger, change the program. Okay, made it go sort of slide up and down when you turned a knob. And then I programmed in a ball and made it go at certain speeds and certain angles and I kept changing how many choices it had. In half an hour, I had the game completed. I had tested more variations on things like where the score would be, what size, what color. I had tested more variations. It would have taken me the rest of my life to have done in hard work. So I called Steve Jobs over to my apartment where I'd done it and, and sat on the floor with the wires and I showed him how this game played and I was shaking. I was quivering. I said, oh my God, now that games are software, they're never going to be the same. So we have